Hey yeah, Brian here and this week at the movies we're going to talk about The Meg. Now, if it's on a scale of Sharknado to Jaws, The Meg's like here. So it's not really good, but it's not really bad good, it's just bad. But I'm going to tell you more about it anyway. So it stars Jason Statham, Ruby Rose, Rain Wilson, who you might remember as Dwight from the US office, and also Li Bingbing, she's a massive actress in China, and she's 45, she doesn't look 45. The whole thing starts in a submarine where Jason Statham has to come and save the day. He does a lot of that. Basically the whole movie should have been called Jason Statham Saves Every Day. Maybe. That would have been a better title than The Meg because that doesn't even make much sense. So, a new massive structure is built for scientific exploration underneath the Mariana Trench. So it's back there, it's underneath. And this millionaire, played by Rain Wilson, comes in and he's like, okay, yeah, we need to go exploring. Yeah, everyone go exploring. Li Bing Bing's like, yeah, I want to go exploring. And then of course everyone gets stuck and Jason Statham's like, I'm not doing this again. And they're like, hey, your ex-wife is down there. He's like, my ex-wife? He's like, yeah, your ex-wife that the story doesn't evolve on whatsoever. It doesn't really make much sense. So, of course, Jason Statham comes, even though he doesn't really talk to his ex-wife much during the entire movie. And he does, of course, save the day many times. He, we learn that he swims really, 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 really fast. But that's training, in fairness. He did dive for the 1990 UK Commonwealth Games, there is links on YouTube, you can go find it, it is a real thing that did happen. Now, the story itself, a bit iffy at the best. So basically, they go down, they save them, the second time they were saved, the Megalodon follows them back up, they're like, uh oh, we gotta kill this guy, and they kill the baby, that's right, there's a bigger one, and basically the entire movie is trying to kill this bigger one. Uh, the story itself doesn't really make sense because at some stages it tries to be a thriller, some stages it's a horror, some stages it's a comedy, some stages it's a drama, and none of it really makes sense, none of it's really consistent. There is one funny scene on a beach, I'm not going to tell you about it because if you do go see it, it you're going to enjoy it, it's going to be the only part of the movie you do really enjoy. But the whole movie is basically, who's going to survive the Megalodon eating them, and if you're CG not CGI'd right, that means you're going to die. And also, if you're not a main character, probably gonna die but the whole movie itself it was it was a bit of fun Do you know I mean I had fun at some stages but I wouldn't really recommend seeing it so overall I'm gonna give it six Jason Statham's jumping off a diving board for the UK and the Commonwealth Games in 1990 out of ten Jason Statham's jumping off a diving board for the UK and the Commonwealth Games in 1990